let's get right into it. Number 8. The Methuselah Star Scientists estimate the universe is about 13.8 billion years old, but this rebellious star, HD Wartino 283, might be 16 billion years old. That's like finding out your grandfather was born before his own parents. Scientists checked their work multiple times using everything from parallax measurements to spectroscopy. That's basically like taking a star's fingerprints, DNA test, and dental records all at once. This star is made almost entirely of hydrogen and helium, with barely any iron. That's like finding a flip phone at the Apple Store. The lack of iron tells us this star formed when the universe was extremely young. Scientists later refined their measurements and now think it's about 14.5 billion years old, which is still awkwardly close to the universe's age. There's an uncertainty margin of about 800 million years in these measurements. That's a rounding error larger than all of human history. Either our understanding of stellar evolution needs a major update, or our measurements of the universe's age aren't as accurate as we thought. This cosmic senior citizen is forcing scientists to rethink everything they know about stellar evolution. Number 7. The See-Through Galaxy Imagine finding a human without a skeleton. That's basically what astronomers found when they spotted this weird galaxy. It's called NGC 1052 DF2, but let's call it DF2. This galaxy is see-through, like that friend who always forgets to eat lunch. Scientists can literally see other galaxies through it, which is not normal at all. Every galaxy we know is supposed to have dark matter. Dark matter is like the universe's invisible scaffolding. It's what keeps galaxies from falling apart, like a cosmic Spanx holding everything together. But this galaxy has almost no dark matter at all. It's like finding a skyscraper standing without any support beams. The amount of dark matter in DF2 is about 400 times less than what it should have. That's like expecting someone to weigh 400 pounds, but they show up weighing one pound. Some scientists think maybe another galaxy came by and stole all its dark matter. Others think maybe this galaxy formed in some weird way we've never seen before. And this isn't even the only one. They found another galaxy just like it called DF4. It's like these galaxies are starting a no dark matter club. This discovery is so weird that some scientists are wondering if everything we know about dark matter is wrong. That's like dedicating your life to proving that all bears hibernate, then finding one doing CrossFit in winter. Number 6. The Star That Won't Die Meet IPTF 14HLS, the zombie star that's giving astronomers existential crises. This star has exploded at least six times since we first spotted it in 1954. That's like having six funerals for the same person, and they keep showing up for breakfast the next day. When a star explodes, that's supposed to be it. Game over. It's like when you pop a balloon. You can't unpop it, but this star apparently didn't get the memo. Each time it explodes, it gets super bright like it's showing off. Then instead of fading away like a normal dying star, it just hangs around. Scientists are completely baffled by this. It's breaking every rule in the astronomy textbook. Some scientists think it might be something called a pulsational pair instability supernova. Each explosion is powerful enough to blow off part of the star's outer layers. Others think there might be antimatter involved. They think the star might be producing antimatter in its core, causing these repeated explosions. The star is maintaining a steady temperature of about 5,000 to 6,000 Kelvin. That's like keeping your oven at the same temperature for 70 years straight. And we have no idea when or if this star will actually die for good. It's like watching a cosmic soap opera where the main character has infinite lives. Number 5. The Oh My God Particle Imagine getting hit by a baseball going 60 miles per hour. Now imagine all that energy packed into a single particle smaller than an atom. That's the Oh My God Particle, and it's breaking physics in ways we can't explain. In 1991, scientists in Utah detected something impossible. A tiny particle was zooming through space with the same energy as a fastball. When they double-checked their equipment, everything was working fine. The readings were real, and that's when someone said, Oh my God, and the name stuck. This particle was moving so fast, it was basically tailgating the speed of light. If you were riding this particle, a journey of 1.5 billion years would feel like a couple of days to you. This particle is millions of times more powerful than anything we can create in our best particle accelerators. It's like comparing a firecracker to a nuclear bomb, and we have no idea what could have given it this much energy. Some scientists think it came from a black hole having a really bad day. Others say it might be from a massive star exploding. But none of these explanations really work. It's like finding a bullet that could shoot through an entire planet. Something out there is accelerating particles to impossible energies, and we have no clue what it is. Number 4. The Universe's Problem Children The James Webb Space Telescope recently spotted galaxies that make absolutely no sense. 
These massive organized collections of billions of stars are showing up just a few hundred million years after the Big Bang. In cosmic terms, that's like expecting a five-minute-old baby to do calculus. These galaxies are so mature, they're basically the universe's version of those kids who were already shaving in fourth grade. According to our best theories, galaxies should take billions of years to form and mature. They start as messy clouds of gas, slowly gathering more material. Then gravity gradually pulls everything together into those beautiful spiral shapes we see today. But these early galaxies are already organized and massive. It's like they showed up to the cosmic party way before their invitation said to arrive. Some scientists think we got the universe's age wrong. Others suggest super-powered black holes might be giving these galaxies a growth boost. These galaxies are so heavy and well-organized that they're challenging our entire model of how the universe works. It's like finding out that everything we know about cooking is wrong because someone just made a souffle in a microwave. The James Webb Telescope keeps finding more of these impossible galaxies. At this point, astronomers are probably afraid to check their email in case Webb has found another galaxy that breaks physics. Number 3. The Wall That Shouldn't Exist the Hercules Wall is so massive it breaks the rules of physics. We're talking about a structure that's 10 billion light-years across. To put that in perspective, our entire Milky Way galaxy is only 100,000 light-years wide. That means this wall is 100,000 times bigger than our galaxy. According to our understanding of the universe, structures this big shouldn't exist. It's like finding a skyscraper made of jello. The physics just don't work. The universe has this rule called the cosmological principle. Everything should be fairly evenly distributed when you look at really big scales, but this wall completely violates that principle. Scientists found this monster by tracking gamma-ray bursts, the universe's biggest explosions. They noticed that a bunch of these explosions were happening in the same region, way too many to be a coincidence. This wall is so big that light takes 10 billion years to cross it. That means if aliens on one end of the wall sent a message to aliens on the other end, they'd have to wait 10 billion years for a reply. We can't even see most of it. What we're looking at is just the skeleton of this thing, outlined by these massive explosions. It's like trying to map a city by only looking at where the fireworks go off. Scientists are still debating if our understanding of physics needs a complete overhaul. The Hercules Wall stands as proof that even the universe likes to break its own rules. Number 2. The Great Nothingness. Picture this. You're floating in space, and for 330 million light years in every direction, there's practically nothing. No galaxies, no stars, just emptiness. This void should have about 2,000 galaxies in it. But when scientists look inside, they only find about 60. That's like walking into New York City and finding only 60 people. Space actually has a structure, like a giant cosmic spider web. Galaxies are connected by invisible threads of dark matter, forming this massive cosmic web. But the Buddha's void is like someone took scissors and cut out a massive chunk of this web. The few galaxies that are in there form a tube-like structure, as if they were arranged that way on purpose, and the void is actually getting bigger. Some scientists think our own galaxy might be near the edge of another void, which means we might be getting pushed around by this cosmic nothingness too. We might be running away from nothing. Number 1. The Interstellar Cigar In 2017, scientists spotted something that made them question everything they knew about space, a visitor from another star system. They called it Oumuamua which means scout in Hawaiian. This thing was shaped like a giant space cigar, an object ten times longer than it is wide. Imagine a skyscraper flying through space at 196,000 miles per hour. But this space cigar started doing things that broke the laws of physics. It started speeding up as it left our solar system. In space, objects are supposed to slow down as they move away from the sun's gravity. It's like throwing a ball up in the air and watching it speed up instead of coming back down. Scientists tried to explain it with gas leaking from the object, like a rocket pushing it forward, but there was no visible gas coming from it. They thought maybe it was being pushed by sunlight, like a solar sail. But for that to work, Oumuamua would need to be less dense than air. It would basically need to be a giant piece of cosmic tinfoil. Some scientists even suggested it might be an alien probe. By the time we spotted it, it was already on its way out, like someone dropped by Earth for a quick visit and left without saying hello. We'll never be able to catch up to it now. It's already beyond Saturn's orbit, tumbling through the darkness of space. We're left wondering if we just missed first contact with an alien civilization because we weren't paying attention. That's all for today. I'll be making similar videos in the future. Subscribe to see them.